A prostate biopsy may be recommended by your doctor if you are experiencing issues with your prostate gland. A biopsy is a procedure where a tiny bit of tissue is removed from your body and examined in a lab. What is the prostate? A tiny gland called the prostate is a component of the male reproductive system. It is located in front of the rectum and immediately below the bladder. The gland encircles a portion of your urethra, which is the tube that empties your bladder of urine. The prostate forces fluid into your urethra during ejaculation. This liquid is a component of the fluid that forms semen and guards sperm. The prostate is around the size of a walnut in young men, but it enlarges with age. BPH, or benign prostatic hyperplasia, may result from this. BPH is a typical problem in older men. It can cause difficulty urinating, frequent urination, and urine leakage. Indication for prostate biopsy. You may need your prostate tested if you have BPH symptoms and your prostate-specific antigen, or PSA, was found to be high on a blood test, your healthcare provider may have discovered a mass in your prostate during a rectal exam, or if you have prostate cancer symptoms such as difficulty urinating, difficulty having erections, or blood in your urine or sperm. Before the procedure. Tell your healthcare provider about all the medicines, vitamins, herbs, and supplements you take, this includes any over-the-counter medicines. Tell your provider if you have any allergies, ask if there are any medicines you should stop taking before your procedure. You may be given antibiotics to take before and after the biopsy, this is to help reduce your risk for infection. You may be told to use an enema shortly before the biopsy to help clean out your rectum. This is done because the healthcare provider will use ultrasound imaging during the biopsy. Cleaning out the rectum allows for better images and may also help lower the risk for infection. Your provider will explain what happens during the procedure, including any risks or possible complications. You'll be asked to sign a consent form so your healthcare provider can do the procedure. Read the form carefully and ask questions if anything is not clear. A prostate biopsy may be done in your healthcare provider's office or in a surgery center. It takes only about 20 minutes. You may be given medicine to make you sleepy during the biopsy. Your healthcare provider will do so first. Look at your prostate with an ultrasound probe. The probe is about the width of a finger. It is put into your rectum, and ultrasound uses sound waves and computers to create images on a video screen. Your healthcare provider will use it to choose areas in your prostate to biopsy. Before your provider takes the tissue samples, you may be given medicine to numb the area. Then your healthcare provider will pass a spring-loaded biopsy device into your rectum next to the ultrasound probe, this is called a transrectal biopsy. The biopsy can also be done through the perineum, the skin between the scrotum and the pelvis. The spring-loaded needle quickly slides in and out of the prostate during either type of biopsy to remove a small amount of tissue. It repeats this numerous times to screen for cancer in various prostate-related areas. The number of samples collected may vary. Your healthcare professional will discuss what to anticipate and potential side effects with you after the surgery. After the procedure, you can feel uncomfortable and have some light rectal bleeding. You might also notice some blood in your urine or sperm. Take antibiotics exactly as prescribed if your doctor has given you a prescription. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and support us to learn more. Thank you.